What is up guys, it is Joe here from Joe Talks Wrestling and if you guys haven't already heard the news, WWE has officially moved the WWE WrestleMania 36 pay-per-view to the Performance Center in front of no audience. This is massive. This is probably one of the biggest things to ever happen in the history of WrestleMania and it's one of them things that a lot of people are going to look at and think, why didn't they just cancel the show? Or why didn't they just postpone the show? But the truth of the matter is, there's no win-win situation for WWE here. Whatever they do is going to upset people. And there's already, like, I already feel for the people that have bought tickets to WrestleMania, have booked their flights and everything sorted because they can no longer go. I don't know how the insurance works with the airline companies and hotels, but hopefully they can get all of their money back. But I doubt it. Um, and it's just one of them things, guys, that WrestleMania is going to be done in front of no audience. Like, all the wrestlers look forward to each year is that crowd getting on the WrestleMania card and this year they have to perform it in front of no one. And obviously it's no one's fault. It's not Vince's fault. It's it's no one can be blamed here. I have insane respect for WWE, even more so now. That even despite this coronavirus, um, this whole epidemic going on, they are still trying to provide us with the best entertainment they can possibly do. And for that, we need to just commend them for it. Because moaning about WrestleMania on Twitter, um, it's not going to change what's happened. And it could still get cancelled. If this coronavirus epidemic gets like worse, like significantly worse over the next coming weeks, WrestleMania might well not even go ahead. But for right now, it's been moved to the Performance Center and that's the best we're going to get. And my opinion on it is, it is what it is. Um, we're going to be able to, hopefully, if all this, you know, if everything dies down and everything goes back to normal, um, like, soon, hopefully as soon as possible, you've got to think about this. If you're a wrestling fan and you're going to watch WrestleMania this year, in 30 years' time, this is something to tell your kids about. We watched live the only WrestleMania, hopefully, the only WrestleMania ever to have no one in attendance, to have no crowd. That in itself is a massive deal. And it's just one of them. We've got to try and look at every positive for it. The wrestlers are still going to be putting on the same matches. Uh, the matches aren't going to change because of it. They are still uh, in a ring. They still have four corners. They still have the ropes. They still have the buckles. They still have the mat. They still have the ringside area. Nothing in ring-wise is going to change. All of that can still go ahead. But everything else, however, I don't know. But anyways, I've been Joe from Joe Talks Wrestling. You guys have been awesome. What do you guys think about WrestleMania being moved to the Performance Center? Um, like, comment and subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.